Right everybody, Mark Allen, Creative Scalps. This video is talking about creating symmetry on hairlines and how to achieve that. I believe to create symmetry you need a system in place. Um, I was a barber for 25 years at the top of my game and when I first got into scalp pigmentation I believed I could just freehand and draw any hairline. What I soon found out was um, that to create something with total symmetry, no matter what the style, whether it's shaped up or whether it's a natural style, slightly receded, so many different variations, it was really important to know for sure, 100% that we had the symmetry in place and that's gonna give you the best look possible. So with that, I devised my five point system. Now, if you're a scalp artist and you know, you're know you creating hairlines, um, you want to have a system in place. You don't have to use my five point system, but I'm just saying this is what I use, and I use a system, so every time I do a client, I know 100% they've got it in the right place. Okay, so with that, without further ado, just coming after this is gonna be a little video talking about how I achieve that five point system. Once we've got the natural hairline in shape uh, or in place, um, we then go to the five point system to make sure everything's symmetrical. So what I like to do, is that the ruler? Yeah. Yeah. So just get a ruler, right. Go on the bridge, don't go from the nose because some people have crooked noses, don't they Sammy? I don't mind, yes. Yeah. So we go from the central point on the bridge, okay. And then we can find the, the center. Right, so that'd be point one. From there, we've got the corners here and here. I right, would call that point one, point two, point three. When we bring it down, this point to this point should be equal, okay? Then we've got point four and point five. With the side areas, always keep it behind the eye socket. Here, behind the eye socket. Anywhere behind there, you're gonna be all good, all right? Point one, point two, point three, four, five. Then five points in place, you've got a banging hairline. So with the five points in place, that's where you can start adjusting your hairline, all right? So with Sammy's natural hairline, is dipped at the front and then it slightly recedes back. All right, but if you wanted to change the shape, you can use these five points. You could have a slightly more curved shape. You can sharpen up the sides. Give you a more slightly curved shape, sharp size. You can use them points to curve the sides. You know, anything's possible when you use the five point system. 